Hey, what's up, you guys? This is Rob from A Gay Guy Plays, and today on the snapshot, they've made sucking super cool when we take a look at the It's All's Cold Snap. Now, Cold Snap is an augment that currently drops off of, like, every Arcwing Eximus out there. I'm convinced that at some point they're gonna fine-tune the Arcwing drop tables, so I'll leave a link in the description box below so that I won't be forced to annotate this shit. Okay, so as you all know, I am a big fan of the It's All. It's highly mobile, can drop into stealth, and create drones that attract enemy aggression. However, the one ability that I never truly felt fit in its kit was Cosmic Crush. For those of you who don't know, at max rank, this basically creates a 140 meter vacuum that pulls enemies towards you a set distance. After an animation completes, it releases a 140 meter shockwave that deals 1,500 points of damage at its epicenter that diminishes as it travels outwards. Now, the ability to suck enemies towards you, combined with a bit of an animation lock, alongside really low health and shielding can leave you a bit exposed, especially if you're not using this in tandem with the rest of the It's All's kit. That is, until now. This Arcwing modifier inflicts the cold status to all enemies within range and completely freezes enemies near the epicenter for 5 seconds. Now, this is fantastic since the cold status slows enemy movement, fire rate, and attack speed by 50% for 6 seconds, giving you a little bit of time to get out of the animation and take evasive maneuvers if necessary. It's also an amazing way to intercept enemies and get some easy kills while their movement is impaired. In addition, the ability now combos even better with itself, as the constant sucking leaves enemies slowed allowing you to suck them even closer to the epicenter, dealing more damage and potential freezing them. Now, from playtesting, while duration mods do increase the length of the freeze, it doesn't seem to increase the duration of the cold proc. Now, as for the snapshot, as I've said before, modding Arcwings is super easy as there just aren't very many mods. So, I slapped in all of the common sense mods alongside Cold Snap, with Hyperion Thrusters being the only feasible quality of life mod that I left out. Now, as for tips and tricks, there's really only one or two that I can give you for this one. First off, while this does add another layer to your defense, I'd still highly suggest comboing this with your invisibility or even your drones, as while this will slow any Enemies, it won't stop incoming projectiles they've already fired. Now, if you've got no preparation time before dropping a crush, I'd suggest moving the second you're free from the animation in order to dodge any fire that may have been directed at you before you cast it. But I mean, that is just the natural progression of things. You get to sucking, and eventually they're gonna end up shooting right at you. So, thank you all for watching another quickie, and as always, stay tuned for more Arcwing snapshots here at A Gay Guy Plays.